Hello everybody, it's me EasyCraft here again and I was just wanting to show you guys a really quick video because in every few episodes or so I put my world up for download so that you guys can play it as well and I just realized that you might not know how to uh, actually use my world like you can download it and then you don't know what to do and I've mentioned how to do it in a couple of my videos um, just mentioned it, not actually showing you how, but today I'm going to actually show you how to do it. So basically, for an example, I'm going to be using S uh, Syndicate World from his video. This is an older world of his, but this is the world. So I downloaded it off the internet, and then I, <coughs> I put it straight onto my desktop right here. Now, what you do next is once you have your world, I'm on a Mac, by the way. What you do is you go up to your Finder. If you're on an old version of Mac then if you're if you're on an older version of Mac just go straight to your library if you're on a newer version of Mac like me you don't have your library in the normal here if you're on a newer Mac like me you don't have your library it's not there so to find it what you do is you click on go hold down option and then the option for library will pop up click on library and then it puts you there if you already have library um, if you already have it on, if you still have it on your computer, then it's okay. You don't have to do that option step. Anyway, click and do application support. And also, if you're on a PC, what you do is you go, you click on your start button, and then you have your uh, search bar right here. What you type in is percent app data percent. Type that exact in, and you'll find it. That's only if you're on a PC, though. So, yeah. Okay. So you're in your desktop. No, you're not in your desktop. I lied. Okay. You're in your library, which now isn't there, so I have to do it again. And actually click on library. <laughs> click on application support. Then you'll find Minecraft. Click on that. Now here's a ton of folders. This folder is for modding and other things. Don't worry about that or 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 that. This is what we want. Saves. As well as texture packs, there's a folder called saves. This is where all of your saved worlds are stored. Let me just change this to make it accurate. Um, as you see here, I have Syndicate's world from here, right here, and I can play as it. When in my Diamond Land project videos, you've probably seen this the Syndicate project world, whatever it is. It's there. So what you do is once you you have this .zip file, it's probably a .zip. It usually is. Now, if you're on a Mac, you can just double click it and it turns into a file. Um, that's going to take a while. So, <laughs> sorry, just give that a second. <laughs> Done. Okay. Now, if you're on, it has to be a folder, it can't be a .zip. And if you're on a PC, I don't know how to make it into a folder, you just have to. So once you have it as a folder, you just put it right into the save files and bam, when you go onto your Minecraft, it will all be set up. Now, one last thing. This is a very important note. I know if you're on a new Mac, it's a pain to always go to Go and then Option and then Library, but you have to do that. If you drag either Application Support or your Minecraft folder, if you drag that out and put it here, it won't work. It just won't. If you want to have easier access, what you do is you need to go into your um, library. I did application support. Right click application support and click on make alias. Now drag this onto your desktop and then whenever you click this, it lets you access the folder. If you, but if you just move this file straight out, it won't work. It doesn't, it doesn't do anything. When you, if you try to edit it, edit the Minecraft file, it won't work. Anyway, that's how you install a world into your um, Minecraft that you've downloaded off the internet. Just to show you it works, I'll show you. I already have that world in my fold. In uh, I already have that world here anyway, so it's going to be nothing new. But give it a couple seconds here. Single player and bam, there it is. It works. So yeah, that's how you put um, worlds into your Minecraft that you've downloaded off the internet. If you have any questions, put them in the comments. I'll be sure to answer them as soon as I can. Um, thanks for watching. I hope I helped. This has been EasyCraft, and I'll see you next time. Bye.